more fun. Marjorie, I'm just about to type you back. I'm just about to reply back to you. <laughs> you show up. I swear, Craig. I swear. Okay. Okay, so, hey, face you. Did you get my message on IG too? Hey, Kimberly, I am blessed, honey. I am blessed. I'm everywhere. Yes, you are, because you. I was just getting ready <laughs> to reply back to you. And I'm talking to Miss Honey on uh, Instagram, too. Lord, I swear, honey. Okay. Okay, so just to answer some of y'all questions, um, I am chatting with some of y'all because I was just listening to the replay of last night's live um, as background, okay, because I was planning out my week of projects. Hold on. So I was planning out my week of projects that's right you y'all are true nistas because honey i'm talking and then here come y'all show up okay y'all is y'all is the crew honey um miss honey says she in this piece hey shima um yes congratulations to the winner she was in here last night and so since i was listening to some of the comment um listening to things that we was talking about last night. Um, I was just replying back to some of y'all and face you. I was asking you, um, what did I ask you? I thought, I, are you face you peaches underscore peaches on um, Instagram? Okay, Marjorie, we here together now, girl. I'm over here I'm on YouTube land, okay? Um, what did I send her? Okay, she said yes. So I had asked you what dress were you talking about last night um when we were on live? Because it was a couple of y'all that I see in the um the live that was referencing to certain things that um y'all was wondering if I would ever part with. So, I'm feeling generous because I did go thrifting today. So, today was Mr. Long's spa day. And um, I was, you know, I was, the, I was the help to get him there on time and all of that stuff. And then while he was getting himself together, I went out and I was thrifting. And I think I, I, I always feel like I stole something when I leave. I do. I always feel like that, y'all. So sad. Um, I cooked today, and I keep eating every two seconds. Now I know why I don't cook. Really? Really, Marjorie? I swear you is so funny. <laughs> I didn't reply because you was right. It's polka dots. Yes, I had left you a message. There's charms. Okay. So, to save me um, some workload on uh, this week of recording and editing and all of that stuff, why not just come on here live and show y'all, like, in the moment, right now, what I bought. Now, I'm not going to try any, anything on. I'm just going to show y'all because y'all may see some of these pieces this week in the new lineup, okay, in the, in the new collection. Y'all may see some of these um, pieces. So, um, 
let's see. I just want to wait like four more minutes because, you know, everybody probably didn't get the memo. Okay. They probably trying to get over here. Charms, Marjorie was the first one in the room. The first in the room. Okay. Okay, so let me just let everybody on IG know that um, we over here, okay? Okay, I think I know what dress you talking about, Face You. I had my eye on it for the longest, but she got me sorted with a similar one. <laughs> No, no, Marjorie, no. Um, me and you actually have the same dress that I know you're talking about. It's black and white polka dots. And um, I think the dress that face you is talking about has pink, black, shades of pink polka dots in it, okay? Charms, I'm eating like a pig. Hey, Miss Jackson. Okay, so let me just let them know over here on IG. All right, y'all. If you are over here on IG, why don't y'all come on over here and join us over here on YouTube? Because I'm going to do a live thrift haul. And um, you guys can see what I got today. Because some of these things may be in the live sale on Thursday. Okay, okay. Okay. So, so let's see. Let's see. It's eight thirty-eight. Got two two minutes. Okay, let me see. Yeah, Jada just did her hair. All them inches. It wasn't even that long. Tara. It's pretty, all gingery. Okay, let's see. I still remember outfits you wore when you lived in Georgia. Girl, okay. I wish I could get my hands on some of that stuff. Listen, this is the challenge. This is the challenge. If you remember, whatever y'all remember, um, you should screenshot or take a picture because you never know. I might bring it out. I might bring it out because... Yeah, my closet is crazy. Okay. And um, I told y'all I'm not going to stop shopping. So, um, you know, just, I might as well just share. Okay. Just share. So, face you, I'm a, I think I'm going to go run and see if me and you talking about the same dress. Because I don't, I don't know. I think we are. I'll be right back. Oh. Okay, so for face you, she did, yes, she did her hair herself. She, she always doing something, okay? Um, she's super talented. Yes, she is. Um, I'll ask her when she walk back in here, because she going to walk back in here. I remember the LV sweater and the green Marjorie. <laughs> Lord have mercy. Is it this dress face you? Is it this one? Because this is the dress I keep thinking you talking about when you reference this dress. Because I have so many people asking me for that dress. Who's singing for us? Um, What you mean, girl? Who's singing? Intermission? Oh, I ain't singing. Hold on. Hold on, y'all. Cause... 
Did I post it? Oh, here we go. Okay, y'all. I'm about to get started. Who's singing for us? I ain't got no singer on here tonight, boo. I ain't got no singer tonight, okay? I ain't got, it's just me. Y'all just got me. And I hope that's good enough, okay? So, this is what uh, I thrifted today. <laughs> Three bags, okay? Three bags. Now, uh, come on, get in your bed, boy. Girl, you had left the room, so. Oh, come on, you supposed to entertain them. Um, Marjorie, you the entertainment girl. Three bags, three bags, and this is all for a hundred and twenty five dollars total. Do I have a receipt? Because I don't want y'all to know I'm that chick. Okay, all right. I don't know where my wallet at, y'all. So let's see. Three big bags, yes, most definitely. Um. Miss Jackson just hit you with a note, Charms, with a little dance, with a little, a little, a little drum, a little beat, and all of that. She's a sad part. I think that's it. Was that the dress you had on at the mall? I can't remember was where you was, but I think so. Um, I wore that dress to New York when I was on the Wendy Williams show. Um the mall i have worn it probably once to primark um but there's very few items y'all will see me like repeat okay so i don't know how long ago you saw that but i love that dress okay i heard it all okay so this is this is what i'm gonna show y'all first so first i got Hold up. Okay. This cute bag, okay? Cute little bag. See the shape? Okay. Opens up. Snap open. All right. Boom. All right. And it has. Okay, okay, you can be cute. And you, hey, Asia. Oh, Charms, you and Miss Jackson need to be nice. Oh my gosh, talking about something <laughs> that band sucks. So this was a, um, this is a bag I got today. I got these fringed cowboy boots okay and they look real good on my legs might I add okay these are a size oh y'all saw I was looking for my glasses child let me see not my band they are HBCU oh no that's right Hey, Tamika. Okay, so these are a size nine and a half. Okay, size nine and a half. And they look real cute on, all right? So I got these today. Okay, so I've been wanting to do this um, cropped blazer where I can um, take the blazer myself. That girl, Ben, I came in here and took my scissors. Hold on, y'all. Cause see, I'm about to, I'm about, y'all about to see me going to mama mode. Cause I know what I said. Oh, okay. Okay, because you know you can't be cutting 
you can't be cutting your clothes with scissors that you cut your hair with, okay? You you you, you can't do that, okay? You can't. So these is cutting clothes scissors right here. So this blazer. I purposely bought this to where it fits me like a little snug because I'm gonna crop it and I'm gonna crop it right here. I'm gonna cut it and because it got that one button, it's gonna be perfect. And it's in this paisley print. So I'm start doing some um some reinventing to some of these things for y'all, okay? Thank you, Lord. She found those. <laughs> Cause she, girl, you know, you know, all it would take is her to cut hair with these one time. And these things would be dull. Okay. So the next piece I got was this beautiful dress. Okay. It's got the dolman sleeves. Okay, it's got a V-neck in the front, but I'm gonna wear the back to the front because I'm gonna show some cleavage, okay? I gotta show some girls, all right? Then it's got the elastic waist, but look at this like, this ongoing ombre, okay? That's what I call it, ongoing ombre. Add a belt, let me show y'all how I style some of this this week. Because I ain't got number time this week. Okay, let me see. <sighs> really, Marjorie? <laughs> Y'all funny. Okay, so then next. It has been said that I am this visionary. And I am, y'all. When I find something that I like, I'm already figuring out how I'm going to wear it in my head. Okay? So this is a t-shirt. That was already like fringed going all down the sides. Here's the arm. Okay. I like to show y'all stuff and hang up. Okay, so here we go. This is gonna be our practice hang. Up. So low key, this could be a dress on a chick like me okay but i'm loving the fringe the scoop neck it looks real like casual but i also can throw on some pleather leggings with this and some little booties and honey it'll be about the business okay all right then i got this cute top so y'all gotta put it on the hanger Cause it just don't be no justice to showing y'all holding it up. So this is a vintage top. All right, so it has the mandarin collar. Okay, it's Asia print, slight bell sleeve. Okay, so it has like little A line, got little splits on the side. So you know, I could wear this with some leggings because it's going to fit like a tunic and it's got some give to it okay it has zip closure okay cuteness I don't make clothes like this no more y'all y'all know back in the, this day and time we ain't got a zipper that's this damn long okay on even a skirt or a dress all right so yeah that t-shirt is super cute girl so this could be worn with jeans or some leggings with some either some booties or any kind of boot to be honest because you you're gonna be remember we said peekaboo sexy you're gonna be sexy without even trying okay so this is the top i got today and then okay so this is a dress. So remember I told y'all it is essential to know your measurements and also to have one of these. Okay. 
I never leave home without it. This is my purse I had today, okay? This is my pocketbook. I never leave home without it. Bam. Okay? Bam. So, if you, if you can't try stuff on, which that's pretty much the case right about now, because all the fitting rooms are still closed, this is a cute, short cocktail dress. Look at them details in the ruffles, okay? In the ruffles. It's black, it's a cute little black dress. Y'all, it's still got its original tags on it. Um, How much was this originally? Don't know. But all I know it is, it's my size, okay? So, short, cute little dress, zip back closure. It's got the um spaghetti straps. <sighs> there is so much you can do with this. You can make this casual. You can make this um, dressy. You can do so much. This can go, this can go from the office to, to the, um, to, yes, husband, this is live. This is live. <laughs> Did I say the name is long? So I got this today. All right. Then, y'all know I'm, I'm all about the kimonos, okay? All about the kimonos. So this is a beautiful print in a kimono. Okay, so beautiful green, okay? It's flowy. If you have on the right belt and you pin this in the right place, this can also be worn as a wrap dress, okay? It is to the flow, all right? And tell me this is not beautiful, okay? So, you will rock that dress, but you know sharing is caring. Yes, of course, sharing is caring. He talking about girl, you be working. <laughs> Look, we is back in the element, child. We ain't never left. We just had to be reminded where we come from. Okay, that's where it is, husband. So this is gorgeous, and sometime before this week, I'm going to do like just a little clip to show y'all. How some of these pieces, y'all don't, they could be transitioned from <sighs> summer to fall, winter. And it could just be about um, wearing it open, layered right. This obviously can be a maxi dress. And also um, a duster as a cover up, okay, for like when you're at the beach. So this is something that y'all will see on Thursday. I know, Marjorie, that's your color. Um, I am short just like you. Let me model that dress. Okay, you can model it, Marjorie. I'm really appreciative of your styling tips and how you give a few different ways to wear items. That is what makes me different, okay? So I'm going to go ahead and just pat my own little self on the back. Because like Marjorie said, sharing is caring, honey. And why be that type of stylist that um, is not going to tell you how to wear it more than one way? Okay. Miss Jackson, you giving out super stickers. <laughs> Let me see what Miss Jackson got to say. Hold up. Uh, wait a minute. Okay, boo. I appreciate you. I could wear black for the wedding. You can. To be honest, Marge, you can wear whatever the hell you want to. It's your wedding, okay? It's your wedding. Remember that. So, Ms. Jackson has sent me some super stuff. All right. So, next up.
Y'all, I just, look at this, look at this, look at this vest, look at this vest, okay, pockets, ombre, and then this is the kicker, I like the inside too, honey, I like how it looks on the inside, and this is, what size is this, this is a 2X, and y'all know this can be belted too. Wear open the whole shebang, okay? This is flydacious, okay? Flydacious. Marsha said, Keisha, how you do that? For real, because sometimes I feel as if I'm in a box, but you have me looking at my closet a whole different. Now, Miss Honey Hugs, if you really want me to have you uh, looking at your closet in a whole different way, girl, book your girl for a session, honey, and we can have a two hour live where we see here, we go through your closet and honey, I'll really get you looking at stuff a totally different way. Okay. Uh, yes to the vest. Yes, honey. This is a statement by itself. And this will be part of the um, live sale on Thursday as well. I found this like right as I went to the register. Okay. I was taking all my hanks off. And James was calling me, okay? He's calling me. He was ready. Look at this jean. Look at this jean coat. Look at this. Look at the details, honey. Look at that. The shoulder pads. This is a hearty denim jacket, okay? This whole 80s vibe. And then it's lined all inside, okay? With quilt. Oh, baby. Look at that. Look at a peekaboo. This was just, it was just sitting there looking at me. Oh, snap, son. Marjorie done sent me a sticker too, boo. Thank you. Thank you. Child, that's how you get tips. And I ain't even have to do nothing strange for a little change. <laughs> okay. I went thrifting yesterday and found two real rabbit vests, baby. I know you was happy, honey. I know you were. Um, Mrs. Honey Hugs. Girl, book. Okay? Book. Um, Michelle, my bell say, when I move, I think I will book you stuff. I need to purge and weed some things out. Michelle, my bell, that's probably one of my most favorite things to do is to help people purge. Because y'all already know I'm guilty. I am guilty. The whole thing is documented on my damn channel. Me clearing out a damn basement full of clothes, okay? I can't go back in that direction. I'm the president of the club. And uh, we don't hoard fashion over here no more, okay? So, Marjorie Self Snap, I done did something new. <laughs> She sound ready for the IT job. Just call me Steve Joes or whoever does computer stuff. Got you. Move over, Steve. Marjorie is in the building. She show is. So this was at the register. I found this. I walked out the line and walked over to, to go get it and then come back, okay, and finish scanning my stuff. So y'all know I'm all about my hat game, okay? So don't laugh at me. Hold up. I got to move this because I'm going to sit down to show y'all this. Okay. So here we go. I bought a hat today, okay? This is a cute hat, all right? really cute hat and the funny thing about it is one of y'all dm'd me and was like um steph you have this hat that i want and they was like um 
I would love to purchase from you. But when I was going to send her the message back that she could, she didn't get back to me. So here we go. Okay. So here we go. We got we got the fur. Do y'all see the fur, honey? With the um. Okay, put my and hold up, hold up. Wait a minute. Do y'all see that bow in the back, child? You is I'm making statements, honey, from the front and the back. Okay. I have dubbed myself that when, um, you know, when I, I go, I gotta find me a place of worship, but, um, when I go to church, I'm gonna be that chick that walk in and I'm still gonna be, I'm gonna still be funking these right here. Do you hear me? Okay. Okay. Marjorie said, this is definitely the wedding hat. Marjorie, this could go with that thing, that, that um other dress that you was talking about. Honey, the nude, okay? So, that's one. Where's my beanie? Okay, let me put my beanie back on, y'all. I'm getting stickers tonight. Okay. So, we also, y'all know I like um, shape bags. And this is, to me, this is the Vera Wang. This is the Vera Wang Speedy. Okay. The Vera Wang Speedy. Okay. It's made out of the quilts. It's got a shape. It's got the wood handles. Okay. It's a zipper closure and it's deep. Okay. It's got no pockets. This was definitely handmade. Okay. Boom. <laughs> She's so glad you see the vision. I do, child. That's a cute hat, and I'll be able to sit behind you in church and say, yes, yes, that's what I'm going to need these ladies to do. They need to, um, their hats need to be a little smaller so we can see the pastor, okay, while he preach, okay? So, I had already paid, and I was walking out the door, and I had to do a quick U-turn, okay? A quick U-turn because I could not leave these there. So I'm going to go ahead and tell y'all, I don't think these going to be for sale. I ain't even tried them on yet, but I don't think they're going to be for sale. Look at this statement, boo. Look at this statement, boo. Okay. Okay. Do, do y'all see this? Okay. It has zipper closure. This is just my whole vibe right here. Y'all know I am the queen, honey. I love mixing prints. And then it's like this nice color. Oh, Hold up. let me see what y'all said. Brought me back to the, one of your travel vlogs when you and one of your, hold up, when you and one of your girlfriends was hat shopping and found those super cool hats. Yes. Yes. Um, my mama said it was a couple, she said she, she, she wants some of my hats, but tell me these is not fly. Okay. These is fly and a real leather okay i saw these as i was walking out the door and i had to whip it around right quick and i had to go uh purchase i had to go get these okay super super fly and this is a statement that you could be plain as jane child and you're gonna be all right okay um a yellow hat, hot, wait, 
keep sticking out in my head. A yellow hat, a yellow hat. A yellow hat that I own? Um, let's see. Them boots. Them boots is all that, okay? That was the find of the day right there, them boots. Saw them things on the counter, and I had... Tiff says she liked those? Oh, my gosh. Y'all, my sister, when she says she likes something, okay? Okay. He to my good job, wifey. <laughs> Boo-boo kitty, okay? The brand. Let me see what brand this is. These are all the way fly, okay? These are by, um, I guess, Eco Ecofy. So I'm assuming it's a Socofy or Ecofy. So they're either S O C O F Y or E O C O F Y, okay? She said she about to Google and find. <laughs> These are, this is a statement. This is a statement. Woo, baby. Okay, let's see. Nope, they're not Sam Elderman's. They are, I'm going to show y'all. Because we, 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 we can see things crystal clear over here. Hold up, let's see. Damn it. Oh my gosh, y'all can't see. I don't know if y'all can see that. But it's S O C O F Y or E O C O F Y. Okay. And that's the only place I see the brand. <sighs> Okay, Cheryl, so I'm 63 years of age, and I've been thrifting almost 20 years, and your style I love. Well, I love different dress styles and decor. Oh, thank you, Cheryl. Keep up the great job for the ladies. Yes, ma'am, I will stay doing my duties, honey. Over here eating myself out of house and home. <laughs> Miss O'Banny, stop saying that, okay? Okay. So, yes, Sockify. Um, Miss Jackson, I just put it up there. That's the brand. Okay, Sockify. So, this is one of my receipts. This is the receipt when I went back to go get some boots. So then, um, Jada has been looking for something. What do I do with the hanger? How you lose a whole hanger? Where is the hanger? Hold up, y'all. Give me my baby daddy. Even though him downstairs. Got it. So, Jada has been asking for a, a vest, okay? And she wanted me to buy her this vest the other day when we was at Target. And I was like, girl, we can find you one better, okay? So, got her this quilted black um it's insulated it's her size and it's just simple but that's the part that we love about it that it's just simple i bought a cream one one day last week and i fell in love with it i was gonna buy it for y'all but then once i tried it on i was like mm, never know jada i bought you something come here Come here. I swear, cheering get on my damn nerves. Face, you say she found them. 
Margie said, I'm going to need Sakafa to run you that advert check. Them shoes is fire. She said, you lie. No, she found them, honey. See? You was telling me that you was looking for one of these. What size is it? Huh? What size is it? Small. They're so big. Can you see? She kills me, y'all, because she always talking about how tiny she is, okay? Yeah, I moved my weave. Oh, where the arm at? Girl, come on now. Oh, it's not big. I didn't think it was big. You was not no toddler now. It looked... Oh, my Sorry, ear. I'm so sorry. It looked big. Thank you. She Man. thinks about me. I do. Yeah, yeah it's going to be part of my collection. Hi. Going back to my new... Marjorie mom. said, when are you going to put up a new vlog? Me? Uh-huh. Sure I do know. the same thing though, like every day. Y'all really want to see me go to work every day, come home. Take a they could have watched you. You could have uh, videoed you doing your hair. That's what you could have did. See, I'm getting up for y'all. Okay, so y'all, y'all know I love moo moos, right? Y'all know I love them, and y'all know I love animal print too. So I found a short one today. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. I was trying to figure out what's the next big thing I'm going to do. I was going to do a weekend maybe when we go to wherever. But at 20th, 21st. Mm hmm. Are we leaving that Friday? Jenny, no, we're leaving Saturday. On the 20th. Yes, yeah, that morning. Oh, okay, so next up. Oh, yeah, y'all. I got, I got a quick intermission for y'all. Y'all got fur babies? And you want your fur baby to be fly too? Do you see? Do you see? Bond has on the Lissy's crochet sweater. Look, he had to turn around for y'all and show y'all. Don't mind okay. the front, because you know he a little rough. So he put, no, that's he what put his, a hole in it. No, that's what his collar's on. It's made like that. That's a turtleneck. See? Look at him. Look at him. That's for his necklace to show, okay? Boy, see, he looks stank. You got him looking real stank. Mm -hmm. Say bye-bye. Bye-bye. Got me looking all stank all on the gray, on, on the tube. You're welcome. So, we have another fur, okay? And this one is cropped. This is a cropped one. And... I just, I like the color. It's an Ann Taylor Loft. Okay. And it's perfect. I like that it has a nice big collar. Okay. No zippers. Miss Honey hugs some of some sold. We ain't got no numbers right now, Miss Honey. We ain't got no numbers. Okay. So this is one of them I found. And then this is the other coat I found today. <sighs> so this is my fabulous furs. It's short and it has the gathering at the waist, at the wrist. It has the latches for you to close it up, the clasp to see. Boom, stick it in there, close it up, and it got that all the way down. So it's got three of those. It's lined. It's just it's super duper nice, okay? It's the perfect shade of chocolate. And this, I think, is a medium, and it fits really, really good. Hold on, let me see what y'all saying. <sighs> It is so, it's bad. Um, Sherelle says, Steph, you be shopping like the funk. <laughs> Love the creativity vibe. At 63, I be rocking fashion others afraid of. Yes, they hate to mix and match. They be scared. 
when you feel scared or you feel like somebody going to say something to me, I'm going to just go ahead and tell you, go with that. That is your confirmation. And if you like, mm, I ain't feeling this really, but put it on anyway, you'd be surprised. You'd be surprised. Okay. This is not for sale. <laughs> But you might see it on Thursday. So I, I really, really, I encourage y'all to make sure you are part of this live sale on Thursday, okay? Um, Miss Steph, did you thrift in high school? Yes, I did. Um, when did you start? I started, I want to say I probably was like 10 because um, at that time, it was me, Tiff, and I think my mama had just had to meet Tris. So, you know, she's single mama. She on a budget. She got three kids, three girls at that. And y'all know girls is not cheap, period. So she used to take us thrift shopping all the time. And she loved to thrift herself. So I really learned the skill from my aunt and my mother. My aunt Dot and my mama, okay? They the ones that, they go hard, honey. They go hard. So this was a piece today. Let me finish reading what you said. I love thrifting. Most of my friends don't buy. They love, they don't, but they love my style. I've learned a lot from you. Thank you. My pleasure. Let me just take my bow. Take my bow. Do my little curtsy. Okay. Uh, <coughs> let's see. You already hooked me up with a black one. Just like it. Are you talking about that vest? Mama Rose is good. She was up first thing this morning cooking. First thing this morning cooking. Okay, so this other piece I'm going to show y'all. Okay. <clears throat> Let me tie it up like it's supposed to be tied up. <clears throat> when it comes to simple things, y'all, I do not like straight away, Okay. Because the way I see it is um, I can make this work and I can dress this up because it is simple and plain. Okay? Simple and plain. So, here we go. This is like a, it feels like a satiny, but it's like a matte satin. So, it's not shiny or anything like that. But this is the front. It has like that apron front. Um, it has elastic waist. Okay. And elastic is like in the right place. It's a jumper. Okay. So it's a wide leg one piece. This is the back. So we tied at the neck, tied at the bust, and tied again at the lower back. And then my whole tattoo in my back couldn't show. You can see all my tattoos in the back. Child, they're not ready. They're not ready. I'm going to tell you how you can put, wear this. You have on a tuxedo blazer. Okay? Tuxedo blazer. And all it's going to look like, it's like you kept it simple. You kept it classy. And so, you know, you get ready to go dance or you go sit down at the table and you want to mingle. Take your tuxedo off. Bam! Child, they ain't ready. They not ready. My body is saying, need some water. Okay, I'm going um, to tell Jada to go get me some water. Jada! pain so it sounds so negative don't sound like she want to bring her mama no water right well stank so i want i want to remind y'all that this is all from today i had one hour <laughs> one hour and this is what i found in one hour so this crocheted this is a two-piece so you see that 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 detail, okay? And 
y'all know crochet has some give okay so this is the top and what am i about to show y'all the matching bottom and the matching bottom is this pencil skirt okay so it's got some give in the waist and then all the detail child tell me this is not gorgeous this is this is vintage y'all and if i'm not mistaken i would not be surprised if somebody didn't make this okay i see i see a tag in the top but i don't see a tag in the bottom so i'm gonna tell you what i think happened i think that this was a dress okay i think this is a whole dress and the dress was probably too long so they cut it that's why there's no tag in here but there's a tag on this side and they actually even if this was like too big for me i would still just paper sack it and wear it as like um put a belt on with this so it'll fit my waist and then when it came to this top i would take this and i would crop it Y'all know it's an easy way to crop it without cutting it and messing up your shirt or anything like that, okay? Crop it with some brown boots on, baby! <laughs> uh, tip said, if I don't get this, can we talk? Um, Tiff... I really think Tiff could make a killing with these because this is like right up her alley. This is, I think Tiff, isn't this like a grim, uh, a granny? I know you call them granny squares, but this is like, it's the granny. This is the blueprint, okay? The granny blueprint. This is gorgeous, okay? Gorgeous. And today, today, total for everything i just showed y'all 125 listen i was in the thrift store this is the first time i showed up when they opened on sunday morning and i got footage of it y'all when i said the line was long as i don't know what i parked i got my my gear together and i was ready to go my cart was full like in the first 25 to 30 minutes full everybody walking by me looking at my cart like oh my god like why does she have so much stuff because y'all it's a process to me i pick up everything take mental notes and then i have to go find me an empty bar so that i can sort my thoughts while i sort through these looks and i gotta i gotta put it together it's, it becomes a puzzle to me okay a big ass puzzle so this was today's adventure this was today. Now, if y'all got time, I could show y'all what I got from the flea market yesterday. And I wasn't even at 40 minutes. 40 minutes, and I sent, I think, Keisha, what was it? 71? That was the total. $71. And baby! If y'all got time, I'll show y'all. Let me take a look in a mission while I, I wait to see what y'all say. Because if I could just do these hauls right now, everything that y'all get from me this week as content is going to be how e needs to a stylist, how I would wear it from head to toe. Okay, and I ain't talking about no try-on haul. I'm talking about I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to pull it all the damn together for y'all. And I'm going to show you this is what I do. So, Shima said they got time. Bring it. I'm ready. She ready. Marjorie ready. I see one, two. Let me see how many people done said they got time. Hey, JV. Welcome to the Nista Squad, honey, where everything over here is eclectic. Fly. And, honey, we give no, we give zero fucks. Period. Okay, zero. We do what we want to do and we wear it how we want to wear it. And own that shit while you wearing it, okay? Own it. So let me see how many of y'all said y'all got time. 
Okay. Welcome. Yes, Ms. Jackson. She said seventy-one dollars. Cause I had I had to tell somebody, y'all. I had to call and tell somebody. I did. I had to share. Marjorie, one, two. Let's see. Me and my husband thrift together. He got bad. <laughs> he got bad right with me. It is just like. If you know what you're going in at a look for and you have an eye, yeah, it could be fun. But somebody who is quickly or easily to get overwhelmed, it ain't for you. You got to hire somebody like me, child. Okay, let's see. Ms. Jackson says she got time. I'm ready. Okay, we all got time. <laughs> we just got on an hour add it to our night okay all right so let's see okay so this is from i'm gonna go let me go pull it but this is gonna be from yesterday's we just drove by this flea market and i said james can we just stop and he was like sure honey we stopped <clears throat> He was like, oh, no, you should have just bought Jada out here with you. He said, because I already know how you're going to be. I said, no. I said, I'm going to be quick. Super stickers and super chats help Eclect needs to bring the fire to us on YouTube. Thanks for y'all support. Yes, tonight I done got two super chats, one from Miss Jackson and one from Miss Marjorie. Thank you. All right. Church been over, so she's she ready. Okay, so let me go get it. I'll be right back. No exaggeration, okay? No exaggeration. <laughs> because as I was going through this yesterday, while I was on the phone with Keisha, I just put them in this box because everything, you know, got to get laundered, okay? So let me just catch my breath. Jada, bring me um something to drink, please. Bring me a kabuchi. Mm-hmm. Okay. All right. Here we go. Oh, child, I gotta take a breath. So uh, Marjorie, you didn't send me another stipple. <laughs> oh, she said that's for Bond. Where he at? Him downstairs, okay? That's for Bond. This is for him smacking bacon. Smack and bacon. He coming too because he heard his name. Okay. Okay. So I'm gonna just tell y'all. God just blessed me. He blessed me. He blessed me to see beautiful stuff and to figure it out and to just um 
he blessed me. He blessed me with great vision because I promise y'all nothing, nothing has been taught. I have no, um, no, 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 no training. The best trainer in the world taught me child. And that was the good Lord up above because it was a gift. And then just being around fly ass women all my life. Okay. That's what you got to surround yourself with. To fly as women, okay. So, y'all saw my outfit today, though. Y'all be like, Stop, really? I'm cute, <laughs> <laughs> okay. That's my people. Yes, that's a boyfriend, child. Bond is her, he loyal. So, this is a gift. Yesterday, $71, I went to the flea market. Um, the mom and pop flea market. And then I did a stroll through Goodwill. And then this is everything. This is all $71. First up. This whole red leather coat. Okay. This whole red yellow coat. Do y'all see this? Beautiful red. Okay, it's blonde. It's got the um the shoulder pads to give you the shape to curve. So this is how you know that this is for a woman. Okay. All the way down to the flow. Okay. That was yesterday. That was the flea market. This is the flea market. Hold up. Hold up. Wait a minute. All right. I don't want to mess this up. Marjorie, no. She said yellow. Okay. So here we go. So, y'all, this is an 80s jacket, okay? 80s. This is a size large. It's lined all throughout, but it is making statements, okay? Let me show y'all what it looked like. And I have to show you this. Oh, my this shit is huge, okay? It's got the... Little ties, it can cinch your waist. Okay. This is this is how I, I see stuff, y'all. Okay. So I don't I don't actually don't like it with the buttons showing, but this is a statement, okay. Statements. Okay. All right. So this was the other, like it's like a jacket because this is not a coat. This is not gonna keep you warm. Okay. But it's for a statement. Then got this. So this is one of them circle skirts and it's got the wrap. It's got the wrap and it definitely has pockets. Okay. Pockets. Cute, cute and cute some more. This is brand new at the um at the flea market in this bazaar. Sweatshirt, okay, with a pleated bottom. Do y'all see this? A pleated bottom. It's like a skirt. This says a small. I think this is a hell to the no. This is not no small. 
Hold on, y'all. This is my mama. Hello? Ma, I'm not live right now. Ma, I don't have no numbers on. I'm live right now, but I'm not. I don't have no numbers tonight. Okay, Ma. Do y'all? I'm on right now. Tune in. You ain't gonna let me forget. It's a purple um hunter or whatever you call it. Okay. Okay. I'm on YouTube right now live. Okay, bye. Bye bye. My mama said I want item number one four seven. That's what she said. So this said this is a small. This do not look like no damn small. Okay? This do not. This do not. And then, come on. Come on. Brand new. And the the, the um, local flea market. Okay? So this will be in the live sale on Thursday as well. Everything that I just showed y'all, minus them boots, minus them boots is going to be on set. They're going to all be on the... Um, the live sale. Marjorie's and stuff I need. Yes, you're right. I do have a black one like this. Yeah, Marjorie, I could be so real with you right now. I ain't even want it yet. And I bought that last year in New York when I went um I was in Brooklyn thrifting. So then we got this little cute sweater. It's like a sweater blazer. Okay. So has the buttons. You can button up. I don't know. I got to show y'all. Okay. Because I'm visual. So I'm going to tell you what you do with something like this. Um, this can be worn you know, with all black. You know, if you was going to the office, all right? <clears throat> and then to amplify this, you throw your um your brooches on, okay? So I'm gonna show y'all how this just wanna change this whole look. Okay, so then look look how that just amplified it, okay? I should have put it on that lapel right there, but you see what I'm saying? Amplified, and this is a sweater, like a little cardigan, okay? Now, if I was not going to the office, I would just have some with a little cami. I would be showing a little cleavage, I am not going to lie. And I would have on like some dark denim okay just so that the color can continue to stand out and pop hey nikki oh marjorie said i know you haven't really really that's how you're gonna do me marjorie let's just complete that transaction right now. <laughs> um hold on hey mama 10 y'all my mama for to come in here Yes, blue jeans and a pump. Absolutely. Hey, Nikki. So, this is a sweater. This is really cute. I'm going to try to style this up this weekend. So, before the sale on Thursday, y'all can um, already have some ideas of how <clears throat> Professor Nista done put this together. Okay? Okay. This also came from the um <laughs> the the local flea market. <clears throat> all of the same, all of the same lady. Okay, so this is like a vintage. It's vintage inspired mock neck turtleneck. 
okay? Look at the sleeves, okay? Per beautiful green color. It's like a full, looks like a moo, but it's not. <clears throat> but it's covering everything, right? So you know once you put it on, you can belt this, okay? So you can show your waist. You can belt this, have on your boots. And honey, this is one of them dresses you wear when you was feeling bloated. And you know, your, your friend's about to, um, what's her name? Aunt Flo, she about to show up. Okay. And you just be like, boo, you is not about to ruin my day. I'm still going to be fly. And I'm still going to look like I got my shit together. Okay. Boom. This is a size... This is a size US 10. So this is like a medium to large. And I don't think extra large could fit this too, because H&M, they don't change the way they uh make their clothes and size them. Hello, Bella Optic. Um, really, you trying to um get with my mama. <laughs> Stuff is Sunday. What weekend? Oh, well, the weekend. What did I say that was about a weekend? Okay, Professor Nista. Okay, so this is one. This will be on the sale this week. <clears throat> now, this, if this is not a play um, mixing prints, I don't know. But I'm going to just tell y'all. Y'all better pray the Lord that this does not fit me when I go to try this on, when I go to put this on, okay? Because if not, it's going to be some alterations done, okay? So, we have this print, like this ugly, paisley print, but look at the belt. Boom, okay? So that your waist can be cinched and snatched. And then look at the, um, it looks like aces at the bottom, okay? If this fits me, I'm going to cut it and I'm going to make it short, okay? And I'm going to have my seamstress make it to where it fits like a pencil skirt, okay? And then I'm going to have her take the rest of the material, and I'm gonna have her make me a clutch. I have a clutch that she could use as the shell, and she could put this on top of it, and I'm gonna be just like John Singleton. We're gonna coordinate, okay? We're gonna coordinate. Okay, coordinate. This is, this is a play definitely on mix and prints. And if you don't know how to do it, it's already been done. Okay, zip back. Y'all ain't ready. Hold up, I see Mo Green. Hold up. Let's see. Um, did anyone see her drink the kombucha? Yes, yeah, see? Boom! I opened it and all. What was you? That's right. That's my kabuchi. Charm Sanistas, who getting ready for this week's sale? You making your list and checking it twice. Going to find out if you're naughty or nice. Boom. You're going to see how fast y'all is in them comments, okay? I know. He said going to coordinate. That's going to be my coordinate outfit. <clears throat> okay. This was the deal of the day yesterday, okay? So, I'm going to show y'all this. <laughs> I don't think you're ready. Okay, so here we go. I got my list ready and made it known. Now I'm trying to sweet talk. This was the deal of the day. The only way I will post this this week, you know I got to wear it once. I, I got to wear it once. And then... This may go into a special sale that I'm going to have, okay? But this is a cardigan, y'all. This is a, a cardigan sweater. Let me get the hanger. 
It is in this magenta hot pink. And the bottom of the cardigan is made to fit like a peplum. So, you know, it's going to, you know, pop out on the sides. But, honey, it's the leather for me. It's the leather and the tweed and the studs and all the detail for me. This is fucking fly. This is the deal of the day yesterday, okay? Tell me. Y'all can't see this. Hold up. I said... Okay, so let's see. Okay, so. I ain't had this t-shirt and these jogs on. Hold up. <laughs> Do y'all see the vision? Do you see the vision? You probably don't. You probably don't see the vision because I got on all these other damn colors. But when I pull this shit together for y'all this week, whew, that's all I'm gonna say. This is gorgeous. I love all the leather and the mix of the textures. I love it. I loves it, okay? Loves it. Loves it. <clears throat> now, we still at the flea market. Y'all still with me now, right? We still at the flea market. $71. We still at the flea market. <laughs> So, I just went a little buck a while and got some handbags. So, this one looks like this. Open it up. It's got the long strap as well. Making statements. Uh, let me move this right quick because y'all can't see it all. Making statements, okay. Mix on metallics. <clears throat> then we have this large, this large oversized clutch with this big ass detail on it, okay. But then it has the inside. Um, draw some money, left some money in here, okay. Cuteness. <sighs> hey, Treya. She said, I just hope she live on the edge. Then, got this. This is still, we still at the local flea market, okay? The local flea market. Got this, okay? Boom. Okay, we got, hold up, we got this large clutch, okay, boom, 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 large oversized clutch that looked like it could be filled with the rainbow, okay. Boom. Okay. Then we got this one. We still at the flea market. Okay. We still at the flea market. Boom. Okay. Boom. Look at the detail. Look at the detail. Okay. This is like that fire bag. Oh, Lady G up in here. She said, hey, sugar. <laughs> I could help her saying it. Okay. Close it up. Statements. Okay. 
we still at the flea market. We still at the flea market, okay? <laughs> All right, we got this one. The one ball open, boom, okay? I'm gonna show y'all, let's see. Make sure the phones can fit, because if the phone don't fit, I don't, I don't be wanting it, okay? Okay, I have a uh, iPhone 11 Pro Max, so it go in, but it, it it don't close, so that's not gonna work for me. But let's see this one. If the phone don't fit y'all, I'm not good. Okay, so if you have an the iPhone Pro or the uh, just the regular iPhone 11 or XR or the 12 and the, I know the 13 is out now. If you have the regular ones that's not Pro or Pro Max, your phone will fit, okay? Your phone will fit. All right. Hey, Stephanie. All of this is was at the flea market. Nah, nah, shawty, they, they close. They, they, they close, uh, they close, okay? Um, let me see. So, here we go. Okay, so this is the last of it from the flea market. <laughs> from the flea market. So, we have this two-piece. It's like a sweater skirt set. It's hot pink. I've been running across this color a lot lately. And then this is the shell that goes with it. So you can look real, real grown. Charms, and we got to go to that when you were telling me about last night that my mouth just dropped open. So this is the shell. Okay. So we have the tailored, you know, shoulder, shoulder pads. This is going to be part of the um, video that I'm going to do what I would wear to corporate office. Okay. And I'm going to tell y'all, I done already fought that battle. Because all my life I've had to fight because I was just a fashion forward chick, okay? And I just so happened to have a shape with it, okay? Y'all just don't know the bullshit that a chick done had to go through, honey. Working for corporate people. Boo boo. So then this is the shell. Look at the details, okay? Then can you imagine it with the skirt? Fitted, little flare, put your little uh, black pump on. Boo boo kitty, they ain't ready. They ain't ready. They ain't ready. Impromptu live sale coming up. Uh uh, don't, don't, uh uh, not tonight. I am not set up for no live sale tonight. So then, I wish I had a pants hanger in here. So these. Are some um, high waist rayon gaucho dress shorts. Okay, so they have four buttons and a zip closure. Okay, and then you see that they pants, they pants. Okay. This looks so nice. What a nice, crisp, white turtleneck or night, a nice, white, crisp blouse that kind of like had a little wrap action going on with it. These, these are fly. These are, remember we was talking about um, learners last night? Child, these is from learners because this was part of the learners um, brand. Forenza, okay? I know my stuff. I told you I used to be right there in the store with my mama, okay? 
Let me see what Lady G said. Child, I found a vintage Chanel tote at a thrift store some years ago. I don't know if it was real, but guess what? It looked real to me. And I don't give a fuck. I'm going to still rock that bad boy. I know that's right. I know that's right. And this is the thing. The people at the thrift stores don't be knowing what they be selling, okay? Especially if they like in these little towns, okay? They don't be knowing about all that stuff. So it is up to you to educate them, okay? So here we go. This is a top. Y'all know how I had on my top last night because I know y'all was... I was up here. Hold up, I want the shoulder pad to lay right. Oh. Thank you, Miss Jackson. See, she had to pull Marjorie back in line. Stephanie, do need there's a thing called sleep. Okay. <laughs> sleep. No ma'am, no ma'am. See, security had to come in. <laughs> Oh, Lord, that I will be early. on. Yes, I'm going to advise you to be early on Thursday. Um, Let me say it again. Preview, preview, preview only, but get ready. Yes. So. This is one of them oversized tops. Yeah, so I had on one last night and I was comfy. Comfy cute right here in my crib. Okay. Playing with y'all. And then you take the statement necklace. Okay. You pair it with this. And voila. Tell me this is not fire. Tell me this is not fire. Oh my gosh. I know. Yeah, Marjorie, you did black out last night. So this is this is an Ashley Stewart. This is size 22. And see, don't pay attention to numbers, y'all. I keep saying that. Stop paying attention. If it's, if it's too big, that's okay, okay? Because you can always make it fit. But if it's too small, leave that shit down, okay? Leave that shit down because ain't nothing we can do with that. Ain't nobody want to be around here looking like no damn sausage, okay? No, nobody wants that. That's not a, that's not a look, okay? It's not a look. Where Craig and Day Day at? <laughs> Gotta keep it nice and breezy around here. They they in the comments. Okay, so this is gorgeous. This is how I wear my oversized tops. And to be honest, I just put on some biker shorts underneath and I put on a thigh high or knee high boot. And I do me. Okay. I do me. Tell me this is not cute. Y'all gotta um start getting y'all some statement necklaces. This I got at a craft store. And no, it's not for sale. It will never be on sale. Because that is like one of my go-tos. But I was talking to somebody that I know that could make those. And I might see if I can get y'all some made. Because I think every Eclectnista needs a Scrabble statement necklace okay everyone you want to know why because you got to keep these chicks guessing you got to keep them guessing so they can just look at this it can be easy like needs the letters all mixed up in this okay and keep their ass guessing keep them guessing they ain't ready tonight boo they ain't ready yes ashley stewart is in the house Okay, we got a Queen Nista. The professor is in the building. That's right. Subscribe and tell Granny and them too to subscribe. Bring your grandma, your grandma's mama, your aunties, your um, your nieces, because 
it's never too early nor too late to start teaching, okay? Teaching you how to wear your drip. And also teaching you um, how to just be confident in your swag, okay? It's your mama's mama, everybody, okay? KK from San Antonio saying, how you doing? Girl, I am good, honey. Keep them guessing, okay? Now, y'all need to stop sleeping on the, um, the glasses section when y'all go thrifting. This is not part of the uh, flea market, but this is in my car, and I had to pull them out the car. But I got these from a thrift store. Now, these are some aviators for your ass. Do you hear me? Do you hear me? Bloop. Who you think you're talking to? I see you, okay? I see you. Don't you hate when people have on glasses and they like they can't see you? I see your ass, okay? I see you. My lenses is transition, honey, because I don't throw shade, okay? I don't. I just blocks it. Blocks it, okay? Y'all, these are vintage. Got those from the thrift store. Hold on, let me see. I'm Lady G. So I keep me some statement necklaces around and I get them from everywhere. Yes, absolutely. Should you can find some cute ones in the beauty supply store? That is also, she just gave y'all a gem. I am Lady G. She just gave y'all a gem. You sure can. You can find some cute ones in the beauty supply store. Store too. Also, you can find cute brooches in the beauty, beauty supply store as well. Sunny's too, absolutely. Marjorie says she got glasses, but she really don't. Know. Okay, so everything that I just showed y'all that from the flea market. Let me pull out my calculator. <laughs> Okay, so let me pull out the calculator. Total yesterday was $71. I took $100 out yesterday because, honey, the lady that I bought the majority of this stuff from, when I asked her if she had Cash App, or Z um, Cash App or Venmo, she asked me, what is that? Okay, because, y'all, she pulled out a damn flip phone on my ass, all right? She says she don't, she don't live in the world of apps, she said she lives in the world of cash and she's not going to get sucked into it. So I was like, okay, well, let me go get some money. This is what I walked. I came back home with to see, I got $25. The other $4, I bought me a drink from Starbucks. Okay. And God be my witness. Ms. Jackson was on the phone with me when I was at Starbucks drive in. Okay. She was. Hold on, y'all. My mama. Yes, mother. Hello? I like 98. 198. Ma, you in the wrong live, sis. You in the wrong live. Well, this from yesterday. Okay, Ma. You gonna have to call me back with that. I'm still in this live. You look like you got on the same clothes. Ma, I do not have on what I had on last night. Yes, no, I do not. Oh. No wonder I'm looking at the wrong one. Okay, well, I want 198. I'll call you back. Yeah, keep your numbers. 198. Yeah. Y'all hear her? All right, Ma, I gotta go. Bye. So, she said, my family would tease me about my outfits, but trust and believe I got many compliments on it when asked. It was my boutique. That's what my mama call it. She calls it the boutique too, child. That is what she calls it too. So the last two pieces, and let me just be clear. The only reason I'm sharing with y'all what I spent is this, is just because everybody can't do what I do, okay? They can't. This is a gift, and it's a gift that, to be honest, it keeps giving and it gets keeping getting better. So, you know, like when you sharpen a knife, 
Child, I just done got all the way sharpened back up, okay? I have. But I want y'all to know, everybody can't do this. They can't. So the, the jewels and gems that I find, I'm sharing them with y'all now. And of course, you know, I have to think about my time spent, my gas, packaging. I have to think about it all, okay? Because this is what I do now, okay? This is now. So, and here we go. So, these are the last two pieces, okay? And I showed y'all the $25, 71 minus, pull up, that was, uh, so minus 17, so all of that I just showed y'all, that was from the flea market that I had to sort and pick through in the whole shebang. That was a total $54, and that was from the flea market, okay? So what I'm going to show y'all, this is what I got from the Goodwill, and this is what I spent $17 at, okay? This cute two-piece. Let me move this so y'all can see. This cute two-piece, okay? It's polyester, but what I'm loving, honey, is already low cut, okay? It's already. Um, push the sleeves up. Then it has the matching circle skirt to go with it. Put this on with a belt with the top and make it look like it's a peplum, make it look like it was a dress. Real cute, okay? It has all these beautiful fall colors in it with the purples, the plums, the rust, the corals, the whole nine. This is a two piece that you will wet to work. Okay. And then this, I ain't never seen no shit like this on no damn um, Fashion Nova. Okay. I ain't never seen no shit like this. All right. But I'm going to tell y'all. This is from Fashion Nova. This looks so like Renaissance, okay? So it's got the iridescence. It's iridescent pink. All of this stretches, okay? Then it's off the shoulder, all right? It also got a zip back. And this is actually like made like really well. This is a size large. And all I see is greased up legs, greased up legs and shoulders. Okay. See the girls pushed up. I could wear it as a dress. Or I could scrunch it up if I wanted to, but I don't. And I could put some leggings on with this too, to just casual it down if I wanted to. This is gorgeous. And I think this is like the first dress I've ever um owned personally from um Fashion Nova. Okay? So let me see what y'all over here talking about. Mama Rose, I'm going to need to get with you, but it's inside of shopping. Really? Don't 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 utilize your resources, okay? She's not on this. No, she's not on this live. She's watching the live from last night. Please thumbs up the video. Please leave a comment and share. Yes, because this week, now that I done did the hauls, I don't have to film the hauls. I showed y'all everything live. And um, now that y'all seen everything live, 90% of this is all going to be in the live sale this upcoming Thursday. Okay. Um, we trying to get to 50 K over here. Cause I think I am a channel that is just like, <laughs> why everybody don't know about eclectic me stuff. Don't y'all be wondering that sometimes. Cause I know I do. And if I have, if you haven't heard me say this, I rep for the 40 plus. 40 plus club, okay? 
I love the shorties in their 18s and their 20s and 30s. But one day y'all going to be 40. And now you just got something to look forward to, okay? Something to look forward to. Because when you turn 40, your eyes, you become woke. And almost, you um you develop new allergens, you know, new things that you're um allergic to. Like, <clears throat> bullshit. You know what I'm saying? So, you're in 40s, honey. You start to become immune. So let's see. One bridesmaid is a large. Got it. Do I shop at Ashley Stewart's? No, I do not. However, um, I don't care when I'm out shopping if um, it's from Lane Bryant, Ashley Stewart, Torrid. I don't care. Because like I said, it is easier to make something too big fit you versus something that's too small to fit you okay so i don't care i'll buy oversized all day before i buy something too little with hopes to get in it okay jasmine says random question mama stuff are you still allowing people to send emails and you respond or give advice yes i am so let me i'm gonna give you the email address that you can do that on and that is it's like nista shop at gmail.com and I just put it over here on the banner so that you can see um I actually Jasmine used to really love to do that and on um, tonight I was reminiscing on my channel told you sometimes you might forget or sometimes your ass might get lost okay however just like the um the song say you was blind but now i see okay chapters you got to get back woke and i'm woke i mean i took it back y'all to my first video that i ever created on youtube and it was it was the first fashion show that I did for breast cancer awareness and it was in Miami, Florida. And it was everything that got modeled in my collection was handpicked and styled by me, e Collectmista. okay? And I was just like feeling myself. I was like, girl, you did that. You did that. Y'all should go back and watch it, okay? It's the very first one. It just reminded me of all the things that I love. And I'm I'm just, I'm happy that I was blind, but now I see I was lost and now I'm found. And I am back, honey. Back and I ain't playing no damn games. Okay, I ain't never been nowhere. I just was, you know, sometimes life just happens to you. And you try to find the way. And... I didn't have to ask Caroline to help me see the light. I didn't have to ask her. I didn't. So, I am Lady G. She says, please tell some of these plus-size sisters who be trying to squeeze themselves in these little-ass clothes, just because they make it don't mean you can wear it. Stay in your size. Especially my mature ladies. Okay, Lady G. Um, I... I absolutely agree with you. Don't squeeze, okay? Don't. And just because it stretches, that does not necessarily mean that once you put it on, it's going to be looking all nice and, and tight, okay? So the one thing I think all plus women should, little women too, okay? Little women, I'm what you consider, they call, the, the new term is mid Mid size, where the hell that came from? Mid size, okay. Mid size. Um, everybody needs to have shapewear in their life. I don't like shapewear, but do I own it? Yes, I do, okay. Because I am not gonna be that chick that's rocking around here looking like a sausage. That's the best way. 
I can describe it is a sausage. And y'all know how a sausage at the end or like a hot dog, how it look at the end because it's like, it's full. It's, it gets plump, right? You should not be looking like you about to bust out your clothes, period. You just should not. When you see a split, a split is literally supposed to lay closed, ladies, closed. When you stand up, the split should be closed. When you walk, then that's when you see your leg, okay? That's when you know you're wearing the right size and things that have splits, okay? Face, you said that's right, or a can of biscuits. That's another good analogy. Um, where would you feel comfortable in? My thing is, is that um, make sure you feel comfortable. Because I, I am not going to lie. Walking around in jeans that's way too tight, that shit is not comfortable. Walking around in something that's squeezing your stomach, that ain't comfortable. Um, you know, sometimes some of these panty um, girdles, they be cutting you in your butt. That shit is not comfortable. So if it's not, I encourage you, do not wear it. Okay, do not. Because y'all, these these shorties these days will be done made a meme or a TikTok video out of your ass. And next thing you know, you you wondering why people following you all of a sudden. It's because you don't went viral, child, because somebody done used you as a meme. Okay. Lady G, I completely understand. Plus size, there, there ain't no rules. I just think that um, my mother-in-law and my mom, plus size, and they wear they wear their clothes right, and they they snatch to everywhere they need to be snatched. They smooth everywhere they need to be smooth, and that is just important, honey. Because what what you put on, we gonna see everything, okay? And like I said, it does not just go for plus size women. It it could be Jada size. It could be my mama, my my uh, baby sister size. It can it could be me. It could be anybody. Okay. Um. Everybody needs some um some shape wear in their life. Period. And a good ass bra. Okay. Good bras go a long way. Okay. Yes. It's, um, and if you can't, if, if you feel like you don't want to drop the money on some Spanx, uh, a comparable um, brand you can purchase from Target it is called Assets. And they're actually made by the company who makes Spanx. They're actually made by them. They are just more affordable and you can purchase those from Target. Okay. They have everything that you will see on Spanx they have in Target in the assets collection. Um, I, some of these chicks be looking like a busted can. Yeah, that's, it's not a good look. It's not. I'll tell y'all be talking about people. Not, not out in public, child, because um, I already told y'all that story one time. I was running my mouth and, um, I can't be I can't be getting in fights, okay? I just I can't. Not for dumb shit like that, okay? Cuz you looked out the mirror when your ass walked out the house. You know what you look like. And you know that if you feel the slightest or the tiniest uncomfortable, don't do it. Okay? Violet Blue said, "I am Lady G." That applies to everyone. It doesn't fit or flatter. Absolutely. Skinny people just get a pass on certain things. They do, yet at the same time, though, um, cellulite and um, fat falling in the wrong place don't discriminate, okay? It don't. You could be small and have a fupa. You, <laughs> we have all body tops out here. It's just that we have to know how to wear our clothes, okay? Capri say, what about if you have a big back? What are the best clothes? I would definitely say the, you've been hearing me talk about this, the dolman sleeves, because there is no, there is no stop point, like from under your arm to your back. Cause it's like just open, it flows. Um, anything that's like flowy, but 
if it's flowing and you still want your waist to be shown, you can always add a belt. But the whole thing is, is that you don't want everything like just tight on your back. To me, I think that makes your back look even more big. But then it's also about wearing the right layers. So putting on, if you do have on something fitted, put on a blazer that's oversized. And when I say oversized, y'all, I don't want y'all getting the wrong impression that it's got to be like big, like it came out your husband's closet or your man's closet. OK, just maybe a size bigger, just so the fact that, you know, your clothes will lay right on you. Half the problem is, you know, people don't purchase the right size. That's half the problem, because just because everything got a stretch in it, that don't mean everything going to look right. OK, dolman sleeve tops, dresses. Um, I would say bell sleeves because everything is just not going to be like just fitted all the way down. Um, I think give yourself options when it comes to your sleeves and the fit. Uh, Earth Girl said, I just threw a whole tantrum. My signal went out. This is why I hate the country. <laughs> she said, plus you can't hardly find style or unique in my area when, when thrifting. I miss the whole tri-state area for this type of variety. Girl, that's why I actually like living in the tri-state. Okay, I do. I get, I get to be, I be out and about. Where you live at now, Earth Girl? Let's see. Cheryl Lanier, a lot of plus size women shop in cheap clothing stores. And then friends don't tell them the truth about their look with a. Cheryl. Oh, my pillows is behind me because I could have fell out just now. Okay. I really could have. But you are absolutely right. Um, I personally think plus size. Plus size. We're going to just stay on that for right now. You're right. You cannot be buying cheap clothing like this um, fast fashion. Now, there are some stores out here that sell fast fashion so that you can feel like you're not, you know, spending like hundreds of dollars on clothes and stuff like that. But if you have good basics, such as your undergarments, that's a huge thing. Bra shaper all of that you have the right undergarments that's your foundation the next thing is if you have good base pieces like good jeans that fit okay you should have a boot cut pair you should have a straight leg pair you should have a skinny pair a skinny jean pair you have those and then they made with good material and they got that snatchness in it that's gonna help you in so many ways but to be round here just wearing everything like jersey and i'm talking about paper thin jersey because the jersey that they used to make back in the day is not comparable to the jersey they make now the jersey they make now is literally wash and well and you done okay so you're right and then y'all having these friends is not telling y'all the truth don't be that friend if you out with your girl and they ask you <sighs> I am Lady G. How is looking? How is this looking? And I ain't gonna even answer for Lady G because I utilized her. Uh, Lady G, tell us what you would tell your friend if she was looking not up to par, and, and you needed her to you needed to help gather her real quick. And y'all, as long as you do it within love, encouraging, and and kind words, you'd be surprised. People will listen, okay? Hello. Um, she did not do a sale, just a preview. Yes, just a preview. Um, no, no, no live sales tonight. Um, I am Lady G. <laughs> she said there are clothes that flatter different body types, curvy, inverted triangle, yes, broad shoulders, small waist, pair, smaller on the top, wider hips and butt, yes, apple round shape. Nathan G. You will need to be on the faculty 
of the history, the faculty with the history of um, just the, let's get the foundation pieces right. OK, know the history, know your body shape, know what flatters your body shape. You're going to be on the faculty at uh, Eclat Easter University. OK. Because you, you know what you're talking about, honey. Um, she said, that's what I learned when I wore straight sizes and plus size garments. Body type is important. It is. You must know your body type. And the body type that you had at the age of 20 or 30, your body is going to constantly keep changing. I am not the same Steph that I was when I was 18. I used to be in the kitchen after school making buttered bread <laughs> and eating fried potatoes because I wanted it to be thick so bad, okay? Everybody was thick around me and all the thick girls got attention, okay? But the the the, the little kid the little girls we ain't getting no attention because um we ain't have what everybody else had you know all this this booty and hips and stuff like that but I used to be eating some butter bread and some um fried potatoes because honey I wanted to be thick little do I know it came all in due time my first first uh, sign of it, what they say, when you start having sex, your hips spread. That's true. That is so true, y'all. It's true. And then when you have your first child, your body changes. That's when I felt like I was starting to get thick after I had Jasmine. Then after I had Jada, Jada gave me all I needed. She need, she She completed the package. Okay. She completed it. Okay, hold up. It was it was two more things I wanted to show y'all, and then I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. Two more. Okay, let's see. Solo for intermission. <laughs> Who doing the solo on um, Miss Jackson? Is it you? No, Mama Rose would do it. So I want y'all to look at this. Look at this. Here go, here go, here go. Camo over the knee. Boots. I know y'all see this, right? Over the knee and through the woods to grandmother's house we go. I remember I wanted these boots when I saw these in Aldo like three, maybe four years ago. And I stumbled across them. And I just could not leave them, okay? Fonte, he ain't ready to go night night. Yes, he is. He said you are not his mama. And I'm the sister. So what? He he is fine, Jada. Leave him alone. Come back. Jada. Oh. Leave him alone. Oh. Leave my dog alone. Leave him alone. You just want him to stay here. Because I'll bring him in there when you finish. Why do you gotta bring him? Why is he can't get him? No, because he was chilling. Yeah. You want to go to bed? No. You want to get under a blanket? No. I know how to room No. Jada, shut up and go. Shut up and go. Give me a hug then. Bye. Y'all. I know. These are raw, yeah. Livy. Okay, raw. Yeah. I turned 30 in my yeah. hips and my butt sided coming in. And I was like, baby, BBL who? Yeah. Child, that's what I'm saying. You can just save your money, honey. Okay. Jada, they all saying hey to you. 
Y'all cannot, cannot. I found these and they're the perfect height. And these came from Aldo. Hello. And they got the zip entry right here because I can't mess with boots that I don't got no entry in. Okay. Miss Jackson say Jada run. Why am I running? I don't know. Why she running, Miss Jackson? Um, I she said my body type when I was younger was always curvy when I wore straight sizes 12, 14, 16, 18. Now that I'm older, I'm still curvy, but there's a little bit more now than I'm plus size 2022. But guess what, Lady G? It's all about how you wear it and you know how to wear it and carry your weight, okay? Oh, excuse me, that kabucha child. Excuse me. <laughs> Why do you look like that? Look like this is the last thing I'm showing y'all. This is the last thing I'm showing y'all. And then um, we'll have a few minutes for some Q&A. And then um, we're going to go because now that I got these hauls done, I got to know hauls. Only haul that I will do still is the final cut haul from Augusta because I ain't put those clothes up yet from Georgia. Um, but look at these Esquitarian That cognac brown They lace all the way up And they come over the knee I can run in these Okay I had a pair of these a couple years ago And I wore them so much That um it was no salvaging them, okay? I had to, I had to, uh, we had to have a whole funeral service. But they lined and everything, and they're flats. Yes, yeah, it's almost my bedtime too. Cause um, I gotta get up and do a whole lot tomorrow. And cuteness. Yes. So, any questions? Any requests? Um, y'all got y'all got six minutes. Six minutes. <sighs> because when I started watching last night on um, Netflix, I started watching The Yard. That's what I started watching. But then The Yard started watching me because my ass is out. Yes, them boots. Um, I'm going through my personal boot collection. You talking about them boots I just showed you or them boots from earlier? Because them boots from earlier. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, but I purge stuff every season. Cause I don't get to wear it all, and y'all know since COVID, people were stuck in the house wearing sweatpants and t-shirts. Okay, so now that I work for myself, I have no dress code. I can wear whatever the hell I want to every damn day. What do you mean about entry area on the boots? Because I have big, thick legs. And you fly too. Okay, so. Because this goes all the way up the leg like this. This is the entry area. So when a boot has this. And it's like an over the knee or knee high. It has this. Because it's made to grip your leg. Look. See, it's got the stuff to keep the grip on top. At your leg, okay? So, this is not going to be sliding. This is not going to be moving or nothing. And you see it stretch. So, you need this entry piece to get your foot in there. Or you're going to catch hell trying to get your foot in there, okay? So, that's what I mean by entry. Entry piece. Yes, it's a beautiful feeling. It's a beautiful feeling. 
So this week's Nice to Sell is going to be at 9 p.m. Th um, Thursday night. 9 p.m. seems to work best for everyone. And I ain't gonna lie, me or this, the, the strategy team, we was not feeling like stressed and pressed because we had all done fed our families. We all done wired down and um, we all was good to go. So I think nine o'clock is, is best because people like Marjorie will pull over on the side of the road and um, try to put soul in her number in the comments. Okay, and I don't need Marjorie doing that. Okay. What do you eat in a day? You're looking good, Miss Steph. Thank you. So today, tomorrow, Jada is off, and Jada is home with me. Um, in the morning, I'm gonna be filming the content for this week, and then um, me and Jada, since we're gonna be home, I will show y'all what I eat in a day. Okay, breakfast, lunch. I ain't gonna lie, I do have one of these. Not every day, but like maybe every two days, every other day or something like that. I do have one of these. I drink a lot of coconut water. I just love that flavor, okay? But I will definitely be doing a what I eat in a day. So I'm going to add it to the list. Okay, what I eat in a day. And the reason I said because Jada home, because Jada hungry all day, all day. And ain't you ain't gonna miss no meals with her ass, okay? And I told her, I said, you better enjoy that metabolism. <laughs> you better enjoy. So let's see. What if someone doesn't have a big butt? How would you dress her? Or what do you suggest? Okay, so let me just say this. I know butts just then became like, it seemed like in the past 10 years, booties have just really, really gained some popularity. Okay? Um, but for the sisters that's already out here who had booties, we was like, why is all of a sudden it's just in style? Okay, because we've been had a butt. All right? But now everybody is going to get them a booty. They having a fat mood in different places, and they're going to get them a booty. I don't judge nobody that does that because to each its own, okay? However, if somebody don't have a butt, the illusion of the butt is very important. You have to wear the right type of jeans that the pocket placement is strategic, okay? You cannot not have a booty in your pockets below on your ass. It, that is going to make you look flat, flat, okay? For real, for real. Um, so it's pocket placement with jeans. Even um, when it comes to your leggings, it's about it having good lycra, okay? You know, that's what and smooths you up. It's very, very important to have that. Good night, Miss Jackson. Um, far as somebody... Ooh, doesn't have a booty, but how can you make them look like they have a shape? It's also about cinched in um, blazers, um, them being cinched in and taken in. A tailor is your best friend, a seamstress, um, because if you go get your clothes custom to fit you, you don't have to be worrying about that. Anything that's like peplum style makes a woman look curvy, a wrap dress curvy to me a big bum can be a blessing and a curse all at one time okay miss jackson said please turn y'all notifications on and follow eclegnista on all social me social media platforms that's instagram twitter facebook TikTok, because I'm getting into TikTok, y'all. Um, and now YouTube. I think the, the platforms I done been on the longest is Facebook, Instagram, and YouTube. Those are the ones that I done been on the longest. My pleasure, teach love. 
What do you suggest? Enlightened goddess. I know you um you in my DMs on Instagram. Um let me see. I just gave some suggestions. Pocket placement, like I said, is a big one. And then also paying attention to the color you wear because think about it, black will make black makes everybody look tiny and small. If you trying to look more voluptuous on your bottom, clearly black is not gonna be your friend. Okay. Um, Nisa, you have inspired me to restart my channel again. Girl, I knew you had, I knew you had, um, I hadn't seen you in a long time. I knew that name was familiar. <laughs> Keisha, all I'm gonna say is I'm paying attention. I'm drinking kabuchi. Kabuchi. Okay. So you should, because you definitely are a plus size woman that's repping and you know your shit. You like really know your shit. So I really appreciate your commentary. Okay. Um, all right. Everybody's saying good night. Yep. See y'all on this at sale on Thursday. Turn on your post notifications. Will the live be on IG or YouTube? It's going to be where you've been seeing it, Shima. Turn your notifications on, okay? What are you drinking? This right here. Kabucha. It's pronounced kabucha, y'all, but I be calling it kabuchi. They always be um, correcting me. Um... Shima live sale. Yes. Good vibes. Do you send out the orders yet? Um, all the orders that we did Wednesday, y'all know it was my husband's birthday this weekend. So I had to be the good wife that I am. And I had to um spend time, quality time, and that does not mean playing in clothes. So everybody's orders, all I gotta do in the morning is put labels on them. And they'll be out. So I hope I answered your question, girl. Everything's ready to go, though. Thank you for understanding, okay? Because sometimes some people don't understand, okay? So I thank anybody for understanding. Sisters need a day off, too, okay? Entrepreneurs got to make, they got to take days off, okay? So... I am looking so forward to seeing all of y'all this week. Like I said, make sure you follow me on all platforms so you do not miss out. She said, please believe me, I'm not trying to take over, but I think my plus size divas could use a little help. Yes. Um, didn't I say, Lady G, you're going to be added to the faculty? The faculty, okay? Because, yeah, there's a university. Where you can get some one-on-one -on -one coaching. And one, when I put these glasses on, child, I am Professor Nista. Let's do this, okay? I'll take those boots off your hands. What boots, boo? Kalia says she is plus size. And yes, she says she, she would love tips, okay? I appreciate y'all too, Enlightened Goddess. I do. I appreciate every single one of y'all. But you see how y'all got that notification tonight? That means y'all notifications was on. Now, let me ask you this, and then I'm going to go, okay? But do y'all like the live thrift haul better than me um, doing the video? Because you can still go back and watch this over. This just saves me time when it comes to sitting down and editing. The cam, oh, no. I just got them. I have been looking for them boots. From Aldo's, that's where they came from. Let me see if they got the style and make. They just say Aldo, okay? But try, I'm gonna tell you somewhere to try. Cause I'm gonna tell you where I found mine. Poshmark. Poshmark. Type in Aldo shoes and just go through their list. 
And that's how I found those. And I have forgot I had ordered them the other day and they showed up. Okay. Um, okay, y'all saying live video. Live video. I like the live video too because I don't have to edit. Okay. This is the boot she talking about y'all in camo. And it is the over the knee, grip the thigh. Now there's some pumps I have in my my closet and they are over the knee pumps and they are pink lace. So when I tell y'all these is fire, only reason I am going to put them in this live sale is for this. Um they too high for me. They too high. They too high, okay? But for someone who may be younger, these boots, honey, they serve life. Okay? They serve like they pink and they are thigh highs and they are pumps and they come up and they are lace. They are the bomb. Okay? The bomb. Yes, they too high for me. Um I like I like high heels that are um if they're going to be high, they got to be a platform heel. Because I need that extra support, okay? I'm, I I know my age, honey. And I like walking, okay? I like walking and I like to be able to do everything that I'm able to do with these legs, okay? And child, the more ma mature you get, enjoy wearing them in your 20s and your 30s, child. Because right now I do not go over... I don't go over a three and a half, four inch heel. Four inches is enough for me. Unless it has a platform. Because the platform is the illusion. Okay. So I look so forward to seeing y'all all on Thursday. Like I said, turn your notifications on. Which you worked hard for. What you mean? What I worked hard for. Girl, I ain't gonna lie. I remember when I worked my Charlotte Roost days, I was that store manager that, um, thank you, girl. You don't want to see what I did to my leg the other day. Yeah, I fucked up. I fucked up a big time. But cocoa butter and aloe is, is, is working it out. But I, I burnt myself really bad with the steamer the other day. And on my leg, and mm, my God for the crew. Um, but what else want to say? When I used to work at Charlotte Roos as a store manager, I was the type of manager, y'all. I believe that your appearance is everything. It's everything. It people will trust um, to take advice from you when it comes to you know. You sh them shopping and all of this. People look for people who pretty much kind of have their swag or their style. And I just believed that um, if you worked for me, you had to be a reflection of that. Okay. So I did not hire scrubs. If you was not somebody that liked to keep yourself put together, you didn't have to wear makeup. But I always told them a little mascara. And lip gloss goes a very long way, okay? That's a start, all right? But I encouraged them to when they walked in the door, you, you need to you need to represent. So I'm somebody that I'm all about um, no matter where you work, you need to look the part, walk the part, be the part, okay? Own it. And everybody ain't capable of doing that. But I used to like, I really used to tell these girls they had to wear high heels, y'all. And now that I think about it, I was like, Steph, oh my gosh, why did you do that? Because I did it. So I was like, if I got to do it, you got to do it too. Okay. I take that back. My bad. My bad, y'all. My bad. So um, this was fun. I like these impromptu pop-ups, okay? 
this was fun. Um, I hope I see all of y'all Thursday. And just be ready. Just be ready. Know the rules, though. Know the rules. You got to say sold and number. And then you'll hear your name and it's secured. It's yours. And we always have a runner up, y'all. Always. So, y'all, let me call my mama back. So she's going to stop calling me, giving me numbers. Okay? It's been real. I love y'all. Lady G, you just subbed. I thought you already was a, um, a subscriber, a supporter. Well, honey, welcome back. That's all I'm saying. Welcome back, honey. Okay. Um, it's been real. Y'all have a good night. And I pray everybody has a prosperous, productive work week. Okay. I hope everybody get what they want. Just make sure that when you get up and get dressed every day, think about me. Be who you aspire to be. And look the part. Okay? That part. Good night.